shopping haul from the mega shop that we did down in Indiana Indianapolis Indiana I went to two Dollar Trees and I don't think I've said on any of these yet what Dollar Trees we went to one of them was on 86th Street and the other one was on Woodland Avenue the first one uh, was actually very nice I was kind of surprised because years ago when we went to Indianapolis for Dollar Trees they were awful but uh, these two were extremely nice I and mean, I'm very happy with how it turned out we're still doing the craft supplies and items that I purchased. So many, you guys. Guys, check this out. Mm. I got six. I got six of the crates. They find, and they're the ones that aren't divided. So that when you paint them, you don't have to try to get all those little cracks and crevices. Which drives me nuts. I love the way Hubby stacked them. Isn't that cool? It's like a magic trick. Ta-da! You didn't know he was hiding in there, did you? So, I got six. Don't know what I'm using them for yet, but I got some. You're going to start your own Dollar Tree. I also got, you know, from your mouth to God's ears, would that not just be the best thing ever? That is not her. B. Stop that. Sorry, we keep hearing this weird noise. He thinks it's the dog. I'm not sure what it is. I did buy six more of these little cubes that have like the little drawers in it. Huh? I did get seven. Then I had of eight because I know I got an even number. There's got to be. This, it might be in there. Because I have a project. It requires eight of them. Here's oh, snap. One well, those can go in there. Uh, Fiddlesticks. I know I grabbed eight. Okay, if you said so. Well, I'll, hopefully we find it somewhere. Oh, there it is. Yep, see? Mm-hmm. Tell me. I know. Anyway, I didn't really care about what pattern was on the front. Because uh, that part's not going to be visible when I'm done with them anyway. If, and I'm not even 100% sure yet that I'm going to do that project. If not, I love turning these into other things. And here I will show you what I mean. I made this really, really cute little spring... Right now it's kind of Easter because I got the Easter eggs in it. Birdhouse, but see this? This is two of these things put together, side by side. That's what that is. And I really like using them. I stain them and I turn them upside down and I use them as uh, different heights and levels for displays that I do. So I wanted to get a lot of them. And so I did, I got eight. And they had a ton of them in the store too ton of them I finally broke down and bought one of these little itty bitty home signs I honestly don't know what I'm going to do with it I've seen people pull them apart and just use the base for stuff I don't know if I'll do that but I got them for when I decide what to do with them <laughs> hold on baby hold on show them the size of this box <laughs> it is full full <laughs> All that stuff between the last video and this video. Oh my gosh, that's too funny. Yep, your girl's, your girl's got herself hooked up. Uh, another piece of, I guess it's decor. I'm obviously not leaving it this way, but I loved the size of it. Is this little thing. I'm not, yeah. I couldn't find any more. I was wanting to get at least two of them, but I couldn't find any more than that. So, there's that. Um, I did find the wedding. These are supposed to be for like weddings. I'm going to make farmhouse style signs out of them for um, some wall decor. But they're cute, right? Man, I wish they'd have had these when we had our wedding. I would have loved having those. I found some Easter decor that I had not been able to find yet, but you guys know me. <sighs> what the Hades? Oh, well, it's not like I'm using it for what it is anyway. He's missing a tail. Poor guy. Poor little bunny lost his bum. And look, this it's one's just already... just the knee. 
<laughs> this is already peeling up. So it's a good thing that I wasn't going to use this for Easter decor. Wow, that's kind of frustrating. I did get two of those. There's what it looks like when it's not all janked up. <laughs> Peeps, they're so cute. Let me have these guys. I did get, I think, eight of these. Three, five, eight, nine. Mm. Okay, well, I guess I got nine of them. But they, I finally found some of the skids. I did leave about as many as I took, just because I'm that kind of girl. Uh, and I was, you know, trying not to literally blow through all of our money in one store. <laughs> so, there we go. I got a nice stack of those to play with and have fun. I made some really cute Christmas decor with those. And I, I'm looking forward to doing some fall-themed items this year that I didn't do last year. And I have a couple of summer-themed items I want to do with those. So I was excited to find them. Uh, kind of swinging back towards Easter. Sorry about that. I did finally find the... I'm going to save those for like yeah. really later. Uh, the trucks. I still have not found the cutting boards. And I just cannot justify spending $36 and ordering 36 of those crazy things. This should have been in the hall with the cleaning supplies, but they got overlooked in a bag, and that's okay. It is a multi-purpose cleaning cloth. There's two of them in here for multi- Oh, it says multi-purpose. I thought it said multi-surface on there somewhere, but I thought it would be uh, interesting to try these out, see if I like them for dusting or whatnot. The irony of that is I still forgot to buy dusting spray. Some random items. The St. Patrick's Day pots. I plan on using these at Halloween time, but since I can never get them when they're out for Halloween, I'll get them when they're out for St. Patty's Day because nobody seems to want them then. There was a ton of those. I bought two packs of these smaller chalkboard tag clothespins. They do have little clothespins on the back. These are going to be to label. I demonstrated a, a shelf I want to make in the last video. These are to demonstrate that. Or demonstrate label those shelves individually if the person that I'm doing it with wants to do that she can I haven't done that yet I know oh, okay. I'm trying to keep yeah. oh okay I see what you're doing I got some succulents again oops that goes with that something I don't normally buy are these little succulent guys I bought more but there they are I see them on the edge of that table yeah I'm kind of, I'm on the lookout for this, that wall hanger, the metal wall hanger. And I'm kind of hoping our van gets fixed enough that we can go to Fort Wayne. Because I really, really, really want to find that wall hanger. And I was hoping to find it today. But I did get several succulents that I plan on using in that wall planter. And kind of looking forward to that. I haven't bought any succulents up till this point. I really like the color on this one. Um, the cool thing is when I'm done with it, I don't think they're going to look like succulents. And I'm going to go ahead and tell you now in case it doesn't work out and I can't do what I want to do. I'm going to use them like coral in our bathroom for the deep sea theme that I want to do. So hopefully it works out. Cross your fingers for me. I bought some floral, ow, flowery stuff. Hold on. I'm really getting into using floral, you guys. I never thought I would say that. My husband, I love you so much. Thank you for all of this. Um, they're not coming out very good on camera. There you go. These are white. These are more off-white. And it's just nice for when, like when I did that back there. See, I had the smaller flower pieces to put in it. It was just easier, right? I don't need big flowers. I don't really do great big pieces. You saw in that birdhouse that I just showed you, um, those were smaller pieces of flowers, not necessarily the ginormous ones. I also purchased some cotton pods. Oops, oops, stop throwing stuff over here for a minute, please. Um, now, I will tell you, I found one pack that had three. The other packs had two, but the two packs, I think the cotton pods are a tiny bit bigger. I think they're just a, lo a little bit larger. So, again... And um, that'll be like a fall time when I'm doing fall decor. Thank you, my love. Whoops. I want this to go in that basket up there. 
Um, I'm going to hop back on Easter, and then I think I'll be done with Easter after this one. I got two packs more of these eggs. I really like the garland that I made out of the other ones. Thank you, Mother. I uh, would like to maybe make one or two more garlands. We'll see. But I don't know where I would possibly use them. Sorry. Like, what fell? Have you dropped his coat? This, these have like a different stripe on them, so I thought it would be nice to blend them with these. And then I also found more of the carrots. And I wrapped one of these with jute so it's not orange. I'm going to see if I can maybe paint one or two to get a different color tone out of them. I don't know. We'll see. That's not in the rush of things to do. Okay, you guys. I found these jars. And I am absolutely in love with them. Another one of those items, I wish I had bought like 10 or even 20 of them, and I'm not exaggerating. Uh, look, look at these. And they're glass. These are glass. But look at that shape. How pretty would these be on a um, scrapbooking organization shelf with those eggs that I just had in them, or the beads that you use, or cotton balls that you use or what pearls that you use you know whatever displayed in these just so pretty and then we go around the corner and I find similar ones but they're plastic and they're smaller just to give you size reference there you go but check them out they're just smaller I really 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 like those I thought those were pretty cool Abby liked it too didn't you babe yes Oh, he's over there working away. You guys, you need to go over to his channel, watch some of his, even if you just hit a playlist when you go to bed and just let it play, just, that'll help his channel a lot. For some reason or another, he's got a lot of subscribers, but he doesn't get very many views. Um, and I know it's not necessarily your cup of tea, but he does so much work. You guys have no idea how much he does for me when I'm doing these videos. And I think it would be really super awesome if we could go... Maybe give his channel a little support by doing that. It's okay. I understand if you can't, but if you could, you know, if you're going to, if you're going to go to bed and you don't have anything playing on your tablet or on your computer, you don't have to have the volume up. Just turn the volume all the way down and hit play on a playlist, and it'll help you out, right, babe? Yes. And if you have time to go in and like a video every now and then, that helps. Okay. As I'm done plugging my husband, I also got. This kind. You're welcome, baby. I love you. Love you. These cauldrons, again, and these are sparkly. I didn't realize that when I first bought them. I was going to open it, but it's not the resealable kind, and I don't want that sparkly going everywhere. They are like glitter, see? But the back side is not. <laughs> uh, so that'll be part of, um, what's that holiday? Halloween stuff. What's that holiday? Uh, getting late, people. Getting late. Um, random item are these clamps these big heavy duty clamps i've seen a lot of people using them so these will go in with my tool stuff eventually the other yeah that'll work sorry guys i have an itch and i think i'm gonna call an end to this video because i'm pretty sure we're close to 10 to 12 minutes at least try to keep them under 20 for sure uh thank you guys so much i will see you guys in the next video this mega haul is continuing we are not done guys we are not let me show you how not done we are all that and all that still to come thank you guys so much for watching sorry as i drop you again thank you babe uh nose itch and i will see you guys in the next video bye